Hello, Lifebackers! Welcome to the update that I think some of you have been waiting for. The SolarBank S2s have some issues, and we are going to fix them. Most important. Okay, so now that's out of the way. So what's happening is the SolarBank S2s are having some issues with the LEDs. We have 280 cases reported so far um, of 4,500 units that we've shipped. Uh, so it's not all of them, but it's an amount. Uh, and so we're looking to figure out what the problem is. It's gonna take us a little bit more time now while we figure out exactly what the issue is. We have some early reports uh, from some people, actually one of our backers has taken his apart and given us something else that we found, um, which it might be a resistor that's the issue between the LEDs and the rest of the unit. Just to be very clear, this is an issue that only affects the LEDs, it doesn't affect the entire unit. So think of it like if you had a, an old school desktop computer, that was with a cable connected to a monitor. And that monitor, some disconnects the cable. The computer's still working fine, but just the monitor doesn't show anything. That's kind of what's going on here. The entire unit works, the solar charging works, the USB charging works, it's just you don't get the display of it. And that's frustrating, that's bad, and that's why we're gonna fix it. Uh, but we just need some time to figure out exactly what the issue is, understand the scope of it, and then we'll be able to create an action plan and go moving forwards. We are going to need to produce more units, and of course that's going to take time. Normally our production time takes 60 to 70 days, and then we need to ship it from there, which is another month and a half. So it's going to take some time for us to figure this out. Please uh, bear with us while we figure out exactly the size, scale, and scope of everything, and then we're going to come up with a solution. If your unit is affected, please email us, info at solguard.co. Uh, our customer service team, Janina, thank you so much, will be getting back to you with the questions that if she needs any further information. Most importantly is send your backer number and your serial number on the bottom of the Solar Bank S2, and then we're gonna figure out what the pattern is, what the issue is, and, and why it's kind of uh, happening and how we can replace the units that are affected. Thanks for your understanding and for your support on this. It's really awkward and uncomfortable to just kind of come out and say, yeah, there's an issue and we don't exactly know what it is. Um, but we want to be honest. That's one of the, the big things that I want to be able to always be with you guys is honest about, you know, where we're at. And I want to be upright and, you know, make sure that, you know, we're going to do the right thing. Uh, and we just need a little bit of time to figure it out. So thanks for your understanding. Thanks for your patience. And uh, we're going to get this thing solved. Thanks for your support.